Let's talk about the overnight cold proof. The question I've been getting so much lately is, aren't you ruining all of the gut health benefits of sourdough when you skip the cold proof? I wanted my answer to that to be very much rooted in scientific research, so I went to Google Scholar and here's what I found. A whole lot of nothing. I have researched this topic to death and here's the truth. There are no studies specifically comparing cold proofed versus room temperature proofed sourdough for digestibility. If you know of one, please let me know about it in the comments because I would love to read it. But the research that does exist on sourdough is mainly comparing sourdough bread in general to commercial yeast. I could not find any mention of cold proofing in these reports, but what all of these reports are consistent in saying is that longer fermentation times generally lead to better digestibility. And we know cold proofing after the bulk fermentation is done at room temp is the best way to have a long fermentation time without overproofing your dough. These studies that I poured through confirm several benefits of an extended fermentation. How long is that fermentation? I don't know, that's the murky part. But a longer fermentation time helps break down FODMAPs, which if you don't know what that is, these are carbs that often cause digestive issues for a lot of people. Also, extended fermentation helps break down problematic gluten proteins, which is often why people with gluten sensitivities like a very long cold fermented sourdough bread. Also, beneficial changes in the dough really kick in when your dough reaches a pH below four and a half, which takes time. So have the studies been done on this specifically? No, but I think we can infer from all the information we do have that cold proofing gives your dough more time to transform without overproofing. I tend to prefer cold proofing for scheduling reasons and better flavor, but sometimes I still do a same day loaf. What do you think? Let me know in the comments.